Soumya, welcome back to my channel, The Global Tales. And today, as you all requested me to come up with few exercises that will help postpartum mummies. So I understand that there are so many things going on right now, and the body, the way the body changes, is something that we have to address as well. So considering that. Three to four months after your delivery, be it cesarean or be it a normal delivery, you have to give your body a complete rest. Make sure that you avoid doing any exercises and just engage in good amount of walking and pushing yourself a little, 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 and get into a routine. That's very important. Most of the mothers uh, who become a new mom. One thing that gets disturbed very early is the routine, and once that routine is disturbed, getting back on track gets very difficult. So yes, try and uh, make a routine for yourself. Develop a good lifestyle. Eat good amount of protein. Make sure that you're consuming a lot of nutritious food and not work worry about your bodies. That can be taken care of. And today, after you are ready and your body is prepared well enough, you can work on. few exercises that will help you get rid of this belly pouch now when i say get rid of belly pouch you have to consider eating balanced nutritious meal avoid eating processed food and making sure of reducing your processed sugar intake as well along with these exercises because these exercises are going to target on engaging your abdominal making your pelvis strong and giving a good good boost to your health So yes there would be like 7 to 8 exercises that I'm going to share today that you need to perform every day you can do it in sets and then finally um I can assure you that you can get some great results out of this video so now let's quickly get started first of all congratulations everybody for taking up health as your priority even after being moms and yes now let's begin you need to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon and share this to anybody who needs it who is becoming a new mom has become a new mom and you know basically anywhere any time needs it make sure that you send and share this video to them and yeah subscribe and bell icon don't forget that now let's quickly get started with the first exercise now having said all of these things because most of the women out there are going for cesarean deliveries nowadays it's important for you to consider that you don't exert lot of pressure under your pelvis because the stitches are even after like 3 4 months they are not ready to engage in lot of abdominal core exercises and we are focusing on abdominal pooch bellies right so focusing keeping that in mind you have to do exercises that doesn't exert too much of pressure at the very same time you are ready and get some great results as well so now let's quickly get started what we are going to do are certain good exercises that will help you get better with your pooch bellies so first and foremost you have to engage so even if you are not able to hold it in the 90 degree you can hold it with the knee pressure up so first exercise you have to engage your knees and stretch in up your leg the right leg and engage and simply lift your legs now it will engage your lower abdomen while doing this exercise you have to do it for 30 seconds with one leg and 30 seconds with other leg simple exercise very easy engages your core and abdomen not strong with it you can do this exercise to get there slowly and steadily right
simply lift the right leg and bring it back down then the left leg and bring it back down slow and steady one two three four five six seven eight nine ten release push yourself back come back again do it one more time slow control movements are important don't rush you're not getting involved in any kind of jumping for now just slow control exercises that gives you results most of you will develop stretch marks so we have to work on toning exercises and toning our body as well so 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 relax push yourself back and release engage yourself into an l and then straight 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 10 10 do it for 1 minute engages your core easy your back got engaged while doing this exercise now it's time for do for releasing it because it was stretched out release relax breathe out one more time Let's go in the next exercise that's the dog position. Release 1 2 3 5 6 7 8 9 10 release and hold in dog position release relax release your hands engage one slow two slow three slow four slow five slow six slow Seven, slow, eight, slow, nine, slow, and ten. Release. Slow and control movements.
relax sit on your thighs and give yourself one two working on side obliques three four five six seven eight nine ten relax engage give a good smile release try and touch the elbows 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 relax go for one more time 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 relax so this is how you do it these are a few exercises we did about 7 8 exercises that you need to perform repetitively just 7 to 8 minutes a day and also if you are comfortable you can push and do it for one more set and like do 15 to 16 minutes of workout every day but these are the few exercises safe few exercises that will get your body in that particular direction that you want and once you get in that space after 8 uh, to 9 months you can do the normal exercise and workout as well but as per the recommendation of your gynecologist because every body is different and every body uh, takes their time for its recovery so you need to heal your body you need to recover it and this is the these are the exercises that you can do in that recovery period after 4 to 4, 3 to 4 months of your uh, postpartum So yeah that's it for today's video i hope you like it i hope you enjoy it um you can follow these exercises and as i mentioned share it with anybody who needs it and i'll see you in my next session next challenge on my every mondays wednesdays and saturdays and yeah i'll see you very very soon bye bye stay fit stay happy